for Clifford. And Ogie, the star. He's the star. Davis, not the star. Ogie's the star. And Adrian Sheehan, the manager. Uh, we interviewed Adrian at the, the, the end of the last game. Um, David, the kick at the end of the game. On the line. What were you thinking? Like, I know you were thinking kick it over the bar, but... Um, yeah, like, I, I, I probably had one on the other side where I should have slipped it off. Um, to put us two up and... Geez, it would have been hard to live with yourself if that had been the cost of us. So it was kind of a case of uh, do or die at that stage. Um, I just gave it everything I had. And look, thankfully it went over. As we know, there's plenty of days they don't go over. So I'm very thankful that that did. Adrian, when it was in the air, did you think it was over the bar? I did, of course. <laughs> uh, but again, like the performance day coming in against one of the bigger clubs stacks, um, from a fossil point of view, we, we've been saying it the last couple of weeks, this is... This is, this is um, Dreamland for Fossa. The last couple of months have been Dreamland, but the focus has always been superb from the team. And again today, uh, you must be proud of the fellas you're playing with today. Uh, absolutely. Um, and look, I, I think the big thing is, right, we know we're coming in against bigger teams and we're being written off, but we have huge belief in ourselves. Um, we have huge confidence in everything we get from the management. Huge belief in every player we have. There's probably something out there that maybe we're weak on the wings and the corners. I think the last the last five or six games have shown that's, that's definitely not the case. So, um, Look, at the end of the day, we're delighted to win, but it's a semi-final. Semi-finals are for getting through, um, and it's all about a final, no? Yeah, and I suppose, Adrian, from your point of view, the next couple of weeks is about focus. Well, we, we had it last year, I suppose. We had that kind of a break after the, um, semi, or the quarter-final last year. And we had six or seven weeks. To, it's, it's difficult to manage it, um, but I suppose we can re- go back on our experiences of last year and how we managed it last year, so we probably... I suppose it's just a little bit of experience from last year and how, how we go about it. Definitely, we have to have a bit of a break now for the next week. And um, after that, then we'll have a think about Milltown Castle Main and hopefully. And I suppose everybody's going to go home there tonight to the hot tubs and ice baths and nobody's going out and nobody in Foss is going to celebrate this in, in, the, in the Golden Nugget, I don't think. What do you think? Yeah, I agree with you. Yeah, yeah. yeah and uh, uh, your brother Paddy was giving out that you didn't get, uh, he didn't get the call for the Irish Open when he's the best golfer in the house. What's, what's going on there, like? Look, it's all about timing. He didn't get the nod and that's it. Oh, it's all about time. We would like to thank David and Ogie and uh, Adrian. Uh, the next couple of weeks are going to be tough uh, in terms of getting the focus because a lot of fellas might be going off with these carriers.